What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Andre, and we're back for another YouTube video. It's my first time ever being in Atlanta, Georgia. I was reading, I was watching videos, and it looks like a very, very beautiful city. I was supposed to go today to the um, Coca-Cola Museum, and I was really excited. Uh, parking, it was full, so I had to like look around to see where I was supposed to park. And so I pulled up to this public parking, as somebody suggested. Uh, one of the thing, one of the things that I've been noticing about this city is the fact that I'm, I'm noticing a lot of homeless people around here. There's a lot of homeless people. There's a lot of tents all over this place. A lot of graf graffiti. It's just it looks it looks pretty bad. Like the the buildings that look tear down like everything just looks pretty bad over here so i go to this public parking and this guy come up to me i roll down my window and then he says like oh what are you, what are you trying to do what are you trying to go and i'm like well i'm trying to look for this museum i don't know if you can like how much is it and then he goes like how many hours are you trying to stay i'm like dude i'm trying to stay at least like three hours and then he goes, I mean, this is just a random guy, has no vest, has no nothing that says, hey, I work here. He has nothing. So the only reason, the only reason I didn't like see any harm or I was just like so naive to the whole situation is because in Florida, every time you pull up to any parking spot that you pay, uh, there's a person that normally comes up to you, you pay, and then and then, you know, he gives you a little ticket and they say, hey, now you have like two, three hours to, to be here, right? So lucky for me, I found parking. Again, this guy started talking and gave me a whole story about how beautiful everything is. And also he said, oh, this is a cash only parking. And I don't have like, I don't have any small bills on me. Like either normally I pay everything with my car. But the only cash I have is $100. So I told the guy, I was like, hey, man, you got change for 100 And then he goes like, oh, yeah, let me run over there. I'll be, I'll be right back. As soon as I give it the $100, that guy took off. He gave me a little ticket, like he threw it to my dash. And that guy took off. And I'm waiting and waiting and waiting like a... <sighs> and it's been like 10 minutes already. And I was like, man, this is this is some bad customer service. So I got out from my car. I started looking around, started reading signs all over the parking spot. One of the first things he's saying is highlight, not even highlight, it's just big letters. It says, do not pay anybody in person. So I was like, yep, I just got scammed a hundred freaking dollars. So I talk, I was talking to like some guys that, you know, like parking the same parking spot I was. And then he goes like, dude, can I see your ticket? Let's you just see what it looks like. I compare my ticket with his ticket and nothing, nothing at all. Not even similar. Color was off. Size were off. Everything was off. Here, I'm going to show you. So here's the ticket. That's it. And he says, and he says, paid. All I'm saying, guys, is be careful. I'm a tourist right now. I'm just trying to explore the city. You know, I had all the intentions to support uh, local small businesses around here. I wanted to see the Coca-Cola Museum. I wanted to see all kinds of stuff while I was here. But because this whole situation happened, I am so fed up right now. I'm so pissed. That I, I'm like, you know what? That's it. I'm, I'm out of here. And so this is my first and last time in this city. And F this, man. So he's a homeless guy. I'm assuming. I mean, I don't know. But I'm thinking scammer, a scammer and a homeless guy. So he's a homeless guy. You know, he got $100 away from me. It's all good. You know, I'll take a loss. But you know, this is this is just ridiculous. You know, you got you got some good people 
like me trying to do good and trying to help the community and trying to you know explore have fun you know create content but because of bad people or situations like this makes me like i hate the city now honestly and i know hate sounds like a like a strong word man hold on let me take the seat though i'm parked i don't even know why i have this on yeah so i left i left that parking spot because you know i didn't want to be there i don't want any more people coming up to me asking me for oh yeah i got you yeah right so what i was saying oh yeah so hate sounds like a strong word but you know it's just it's just i'm really i'm really pissed off i'm really pissed off because you know they took advantage of me and I should have known. I mean, I got to understand that I'm not in Florida anymore. I mean, I was in Tennessee. Nothing happened. Everybody's super cool. Everybody was awesome. And I come to Georgia. And then my first place that I parked, scam. Damn, that, 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 that's some bad luck right there. That is some bad luck right there. But you know what, guys? It's all good. I ain't worried about it. You know, it's just $100. Yes, it's money, but... Money comes and goes, so it's this is just a lesson, and hopefully you guys learn from my experience that watch out, always watch your back, and carry small bills, because I wouldn't mind losing out uh, twenty bucks by a hundred. You know, it's, it's I don't know, it's a little too much. But like I said, guys, it's all good. I don't worry about it. It's what it is. You know, I was gonna explore the city, but not anymore. You know, not anymore. I'm ready to hit the road and go to my next destination. I'm going back to Tennessee, that's for sure. All right, guys, learn from this. This sucks, but it's all good. So this is not the type of content that I would like to do normally, but you know, I just, I had to make this video just to keep you aware of the bad people or scammers that sometimes you see out there. This is this is definitely a first time for me. I have never had any bad experiences happen. I mean, I never I never been robbed. I never been in a situation like this. And I learned from this. Trust me. With all that being said, thank you guys for all the love and support. And don't forget to subscribe to your boy, like the video, and maybe I get robbed again. Who knows, right? My luck is so great right now that. Might happen, who knows? Peace out. Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg.